This is how to get that look that everyone is going for right now on socials and on YouTube. You've probably seen a bunch of creators really diving hard into this look. And um, yeah, I mean, I'm just going to cut all the fluff and just show you it really, really quickly because a whole bunch of people make it seem really mysterious, but it's just not that mysterious. This is that film look that everyone's kind of going for. So we're going to jump straight in. I shoot properties for a living uh, and I help creators find purpose and profit. But anyway, we're going to jump in and have a look. So we're at one of these properties last night. Very nice home, really like shooting this one, had fun in the grade. This is my uh, node tree, uh, just, just to run you through quickly. Obviously, this is kind of what it looks like. We're shooting on black magic here, 6K. Uh, we've got our correct tab, we've got our black magic tab, we've got our saturation tab, we're doing a bunch on this node as well. Uh, we sat the sat, we're doing a bunch over here as well. Everything's off for now to keep it nice and simple. Uh, we've got a cheeky little bit of teal and orange light there as well. But this is where the secret sauce comes in. This is what everyone doesn't want you to know. It's called halation. Just click this node and you can see it gives you that nice dreamy look. Now I've got this as a, uh, a shared node so that any, any of these nodes, it's going to be on there as well. If you want my node tree, you can just download it uh, in the description. But I'll just run you through quickly what these settings look like. You can dump the halation on there. I'm not exactly sure what it comes up as without any of the settings on there. Mine is a little bit on the subtle end, uh, but essentially uh, you can go as hard as you want. The global blend, what is the initial? Oh, it's on one. So yeah, there you go. You can see it looks pretty hectic there, uh, but I'm just going to pop that on. Well, let's let's keep it on one for now so you can just really see how much it uh, it affects the, the image. Uh, on halation here, on isolation, this threshold we want on 0.2. Secondary glow is where some secret source comes in. Uh, you pop that on 0.25, that really adds that nice dreamy look. Basic grain, this is again where some secret source comes in. It's on 0.3, uh, put 0.25, but I put it on 0.3, and I think you just have to turn the apply grain on. This, As you can see, you can crank it right up, and it really gives that intense like A24 film cinematic kind of look. Uh, you can see, obviously, this is the, this is the glow that's added. Um, this is just the the default that it comes on there. And I switch between kind of point, point 0.3 to point 0.5, depending on the mood that I'm going for in uh, the property. Uh, you know, I shoot a lot of other different things as well. But uh, yeah, this is, uh, that's that's pretty much it. That's the secret sauce that everyone doesn't want you to know. Uh, here it is with a, with a person on it as well. Um, here we are. Just like really, really just like, looks like a nice clean image. It's nice and sharp because of all the grading that I've done. But you pop this on and it just adds that dreamness to it. And especially when your competition doesn't know these things, just can really make your videos pop and stand out to other people. Or if you're just making social content, literally whatever you want to do. That's the secret sauce, guys. It's nothing too much to it. Uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully you got some value out of this. I post videos like this all the time. So if you want more tips and tricks on DaVinci or creative philosophy, feel free to sub. I don't know, whatever. See you in the next video.